And for the longest time, I've always thought that, like, everyone is, like, back when I, like, especially when I first got popular, it's like, she's a butter face. She's, so I've always, my whole what? life, thought I had an ugly face. What's wrong with people? So it's just, like, people, like, don't understand, like, what, like, social media does to you and shit. But, like, I am pretty strong, so, like, I don't really let it affect you. But, like, when pe some people are saying the same thing over and over again, or I've put, I post something in my face, it's like, turn around. It's like, that's all they care about. It's like, it's just fucking annoying, you know? Have you, Did you ever get to a point where you, very early for me, when I started getting hate for whatever reason, for this thing, for that that thing, it was it was very easy for me to discern that these people that would say really fucked up shit were really fucked up people. And to then completely put them in a category mm -hmm. where I didn't give a shit what they said. Because I mean, yeah. were, were you able to like, when I see those comments of, of just filled with f and fueled by hatred and sadness and depression mm -hmm. in their own lives. Yeah, I mean, it's a reflection of them. It's that, like, well, if that's you're happy and you're in a good place, you're not going to go on Instagram and be like all this mean shit to people. And, but it's like, it doesn't change the fact. I'm not saying that affects me all the time. Like some days I do wake up and I'm confident as fuck. And I'm like, fuck all these. All. But then sometimes I wake up and I'm like, I'm not very confident today. I kind of feel like shit, but that's life. That's me a human um but yeah it's a reflection of like how they feel about themselves and i don't really take anything personal from people who don't know me personally so they can't really have an opinion but there'll be days i'm a girl i'm about to start my period i get a little emotional i'll see stuff coming in i'll say because i get like oh you're old because like you know we've been on the internet for a long time we were people just talking like, about your old news oh i forgot <laughs> about her but i'm like what the so it's like in these little kids minds they're so like fast food they have such an attention span of a mouse they're like oh what's new what's hot what's new that they really do kind of forget about people that's quick. So, so funny that's so it's like they're like squirrel like you know what I mean? <laughs> so I'm just like, okay, cool. I am old news to you. But it's like, you get that on a bad day. It's like, some days I don't care, but you get me on a bad day. I'm like, My I <laughs> am old news. <laughs> no, no, no. You know what helps I me? Acknowledging it. Like, like noticing how you're feeling, uh, noting, oh, I, I might not be feeling like my full confident self mm -hmm. today, acknowledging it. And then also besides acknowledging it within myself, I tell people around me. Mm -hmm. Like I, I, I was going to FaceTime this girl the other day. And it was like our first time FaceTiming. And I told my boys, I was like, guys. Were you I, nervous? I go, I, I wasn't nervous. I just wasn't feeling confident. You need a pep talk? No, I just wasn't feeling <laughs> confident. I, don't, I didn't think I had what it took to like make her laugh and like hold a conversation. So I told my boys, I was like, I don't know, guys, you know, I'm not feeling that confident, whatever. And then they, they call me a pussy and stuff. And that really helped. <laughs> And, then, and so I got, that I got my shit together. I don't know if it was them encouraging me, but like me, I remember me acknowledging it and just like putting it all on the line. This is how I feel. I'm not hundred percent right now. It made me feel better. And then going in with that energy of like, yo, this is what I got. This is the best I got right now. We're going to do the best we can. And it worked and I did great. So you killed it. 10, 10? No, no. It was like an eight out of 10, but like I thought it'd be much better. But worse. that is the best attitude. That is the Acknowledge, best attitude. Acknowledge it but and a, move but, on. But the last thing you said about we're all just out here trying to do the best we can. That's yeah. it. And as long as you look at everybody and like some people are doing better than others, you know what I'm saying? I suck at, at the, that kind of stuff because like if somebody were to tell me like, yo, you're not relevant anymore. Like my brain's all fucked up. Like I'm just like, bitch, you never were. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Like, so why are you talking to me? Like what I'm if they fucked were? up. What sometimes if they were? I am they, like so, that. I, so the ones that are or were never say that to me. Mm. So that's why. But if one did, then I'll be like, damn. Damn. Now I got to now I got to switch little it weird up. when I read like for example on on these comments and the bullshit comments somebody's like yo this guy George he's the oh, I've fuck seen him reply back to some of them so Oh I'll do it so hell yeah I snap no, back it's funny. George it's funny yeah. it's fun yeah. it's fun I snap back but in like a playful way <laughs> like absolutely. like I'll say somebody like for example he snaps back in like a way I'll go way. somebody get this guy a cookie he's sad like I'll just say weird shit but also I I don't know why I'm sick I love it when somebody he's talks sick. shit about me in a comment I go yeah let me fuck your mind up for the rest of the day like I, I don't know why i love it there's I two love being there's mind. just two sides like because i've i love doing that too and it's great to get the feedback of all the other people that are like get them you know like they come and in because you fuck comes them up in and like the, like bullies them too 100 <laughs> percent. the problem is is that it's 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 reinforcing and training an activity because, because these like, motherfuckers are all i swear george no one feels a certain way about you they don't feel a certain way about me the people that watch the show watch the show the, the people are saying this why, do you want to know why you so mean to me right now relax this is Oh, I, I said, oh, I see what you're doing. I see what you're doing. Uh, they they do that because it's like a little lottery ticket for them. They're like, yo, if I get the numbers get right, I get a reaction from a from a celebrity or an influencer. That's it. Then nobody yeah, actually feels. So they any get me on a period day. I see that shit. I'm like crying about it. I'm like, fuck <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah. No, you know what's happened before? 
I literally will like reply back to it or say something like, well, God bless you or something like, they're like, oh my God, hi. I didn't know you were to respond. I'm like, why couldn't you have said something nice? So then yeah, I never comment back to mean ones because it's like, then it shows everyone else like, oh, I'm saying how much I love her and how beautiful she is. And Correct. now she replying back to the mean stuff. Yeah. So it's like, I try not to train that behavior. So if you're commenting mean stuff, I'm not saying it. I'm closed minded to it though. <laughs> though, because everyone's going to say the things that I'm saying like makes me insecure. They're going to like, you're a butter face. <laughs> <laughs> no, but you have the right policy. You have the right policy on it. Like we all need to, I, I'll, you know, speak for everybody. I think in the creator community, a lot of people already do this, but I think everybody can get better at reinforcing that positive mm -hmm. behavior. And uh, it doesn't mean the negative is going to go away because that's life. And guys, have you guys realized TikTok is the most toxic place? Worst, I've worst, ever worst. I say it all the time. In Nothing my even life. close. I'm the only one that's not on the platform. I don't oh, ever. You don't have a gosh. channel? I don't. I do. I just don't. I, ever, post I never it off. open it up. I, I don't open it up is because I respectfully think it's fucking weird that there's 12 year old girls dancing. Yeah. Okay. So, so quickly, yeah. I did too. Then I fell into the rabbit hole of of for you and how good their algorithm is. It is it is phenomenal. It serves you some of the most interesting and entertaining short comedy like content in the world. But it is quite literally four thousand times more toxic than the most toxic yeah. competitor. But it yeah. is it is horrifying. I know you're right because you know Kava. He only sends me. He doesn't even watch the videos. He loves the comment sections. He's an evil human being. You know? Oh yeah, there he's you go. evil. Like what I mean, evil. Like like evil. Like he's a bad person. But I love him. I don't know why. But he says and he dies of laughter at these comments. And the comment section is like, they like try to be clever with how mean they are. And whoever gets the most like favorites, it goes it. to the top. So I it's think like they're trying to say whatever mean and like gets the most attraction to like get their top comment. I'm like. Yeah.